Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, we have a new Microsoft Edge browser that has arrived. Of course, we had Chrome 119 arrive this week. So it's kind of normal that also Edge has moved on. So Edge 119 is now available and you can go into the Microsoft Edge browser, go into the upper right corner, three dots and go into help and feedback about Microsoft Edge. And you'll be moved on to the a new version, which is a 119.0.2151.44. And it includes just a few new features that are mostly under the hood. So there's the split screen feature that now has a restore functionality. So you can actually restore, you know, like you can restore tabs, you can restore split screen. Uh, the way that they were if you were if you close the browser for example by mistake um, there's apart from that a few under the hood uh, stuff like compression dictionary transport support uh, and um, they're kind of tweaking the sidebar app and all of that uh, that is an edge so things that for probably most people aren't really used and um, don't really um, matter much. But there is one thing that is very important. It has all of the security fixes coming from the Chromium uh, team, which is all the security fixes, 15 security fixes that we had in Google Chrome. Well, they're here, and the 15 security fixes contain a certain number of high severity um, fixes too. Nothing critical, nothing zero day, or already exploded in the wall from what we know but still several high severity in those 15 flaws. So just for that reason, uh, you should update Google Chrome, uh, Microsoft Edge, sorry. And of course, even if you don't use it, I would recommend that you check on it to make sure that it's up to date. Because once again, Microsoft has this way sometimes of uh, driving us nuts. And what it does is that you click a link and you update uh, it opens the browser, the Microsoft Edge browser, rather than your favorite browser for some reason. So like that, you know that you'll always stay safe. So check it out, uh, new version 119, but mostly for the security fixes to stay safe. That's the way you stay safe, security fixes, and um, of course being careful what you do. That's 99.999% of all the security in a computer. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.